so where are we? So we are at the University of Wisconsin Madison Makerspace. Uh, the official name is the Granger Engineering Design Innovation Lab. Okay, this is an absolute beautiful facility. I'm, I'm excited to walk through and see what you have to offer. So uh, when did you start uh, the Makerspace? How long have you been open? We've been open since September of last year. So um, I see this is your, your 3D printing village. So when we talk about um, a student staff, I'm assuming the student staff kind of runs the makerspace on a day-to-day -day basis? That's the vision, and I think it's been working pretty well. Here's your laser cutter. Laser cutter slash yep. engraver. This is kind of our more industrial quality laser cutter, the higher end. So this looks like it's more the, the electronic space, and as DigiKey, this is the kind of stuff that we sell. We love to, to see these kind of places in a maker space. Yeah, so, even, even it seems kind of uh, bread and butter, I actually think that this is probably one of the most unique parts of our space, that this amount and quality of electronics is available to any engineering student. This is an amazing resource that they normally wouldn't have so freely available. Let's head on over to your wood shop here. This is obviously your checkout window. So yep. a lot of the areas you see, there's not tools out. So if you want to use a tool, I'm assuming you have to come here to check it out. So students can come in, they can check out all different kinds of technology, virtual reality headsets, um, microelectronics. They could come here and use it for a fixed amount of time and then share it as a more shared resource. I really appreciate your time. And again, beautiful facility. Makerspaces, like you said, are most universities have them now. It's yep. becoming the norm. Yep. So it's really cool just to see how they come to fruition.